In this lecture, I am going to show you how to calculate the cutting length of a rectangular stirrup. Before proceeding with the calculations, let me introduce you to the components of a stirrup or a tie. As you can clearly visualize from the picture, a rectangular stirrup is bent at three of its corners by an angle of 90 degrees and two number of 135 degree bends along with two number of hooks given at the fourth corner. Let's suppose we need to calculate the cutting length of a rectangular stirrup for a beam of width 230 mm and depth of 300 mm. The diameter of the stirrups is given as 8 mm with a clear cover of 25 mm. So we have the given data, width of beam is given as 230 mm, depth of beam is 300 mm, clear cover is given as 25 mm and diameter of the stirrups is given as 8 mm. The cutting length of a rectangular stirrup is calculated by using the formula twice a plus b plus twice 10 d minus 3 times 2 d minus 2 times 3 d where a is the center to center distance between the extreme vertical bars of the stirrup along the width of the beam and b is the center to center distance between the extreme horizontal bars of the stirrup along the depth of the beam. The value of A can be calculated by using the formula width of beam minus twice clear cover minus twice D by 2 while D is the diameter of the stirrup. On substituting these values, A will be equal to 172 mm. Similarly, B will be equal to depth of beam minus twice clear cover minus twice D by 2 and the total will be 242 mm. 10D is the hook length which will be equal to 10 into 8 2D is for 90 degree bend which will be equal to twice 8 and 3D is the formula for 135 degree bend which will be given by 3 into 8. On substituting these values in equation first, we will get the cutting length of stirrup equal to 892 mm or 0.89 meter. If you want to download the excel sheet of this calculation, you can check out my website. I will be providing the link in the description box of this video. Thank you.